says, uh, enter. We're gonna we're gonna go to the uh, Britain, Britain, London. We're gonna break our babies out from those sex traffickings. That's right. We're gonna go on those those islands with Epstein's and them, and we're gonna get our kids, man. We're gonna get our people. Yeah. Well, that's why it says saviors. There are saviors coming from Mount Zion yeah. because when we come back down, Lord's will, we're part of those men. Yeah. But when the elect come. The rest of the world is gonna is gonna change. That's right. And we're gonna gather our people and yeah, those man. that aren't gonna be with it, we're gonna bring them to the wilderness and they're gonna be slayed before our Lord and Savior. Right. And then they're just gonna come back. That's right. But we're gonna rid the world of rebels. It says purge the rebels right. among you. Right. It's gonna be a long time before they come back. Yeah. <laughs> yep. And that's the gospel. That's what we hope for. Yep. That's the good news. That's the that's good right. news. Because when Yahweh Shai comes and with his his men, the elect. The earth is going to scream for joy. Yeah. The trees, the animals groan. You know the Bible says that the animals are waiting for us yeah. to change. Yeah. You, you got, you got, uh, yo, you got gorillas, gorillas. bowing yeah. down for brothers. Yep. You know, you got Coco doing sign language saying, "Man, stupid, I'm Earth. Help, stop." You got, yo, I'm, everything is crying out. You got yeah. fucking, just like you got fucking dogs locked up like prisoners yep. at a, yeah. the pet store, man. Yeah. You ever wonder why animals are drawn to you? You ever notice how animals could be like? That's because our, our spirit. Yeah, yeah. Our spirit. I notice that a lot. My See? little yeah. dogs be, be jumping on me. See? And they come to me and See? Because you know, like yeah. you're an Israelite, brother. Yeah. Because in their spirit, yeah. they know who you are. Yeah. This earth knows who we are. Right. In the time of trouble, you gonna even have trees protecting you. Yeah. That's how heavy this thing is. Yeah. The Lord's using the earth against Esau, the enemy. The so-called white man, ultimately the elite right, bankers, right. but the earth is going to use uh, the the Lord's going to use the earth to protect us. Right. Didn't they say the wilderness in Revelations uh, defended the woman? Yeah, you, you know yeah, what I mean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You yeah. know, because we had a flea. Yeah. Yep. You know, so hey, we man, we got a lot to hope for. Yeah. Right. We got a lot to look forward to. Yeah. You know. Right. So a little more. He always protect his own. That's right. That's right. That's right. His yep. His own. Yep. That's right. This is uh, Isaiah twenty-six and twenty. Come, my people, enter thou into thy chambers. With those chambers, those chariots. Yep. It says, and shut thy doors about thee, yep. which proves the days of Noah, because Ooh. Noah got shut That's in right. the ark. So That's the right. ark is going to be coming. We're going to have many arks coming for us. That's right. But they're not going to be uh, uh, in this water. They're going to be coming from that, that water. water. Right. See, right. the spiritual right. ark, right. you know? Right. And it says, uh, and, and those aren't, listen, you cannot get in if you're not the elect. Yep. Yeah. Because that's why it says the book of uh, Genesis, it said that it said that it was like so tight. Yeah, it was shut in. in. He was in prison. You know, but Esau, you know, he had to show you like in, in a movie that most of his guy in the ark. That's, yeah, that's, that's not true. That's, uh, that's not true. Know. And it says, uh, hide thyself as it were a little, uh, for a little moment. And why is that? Because America is going to be destroyed uh, within one hour. Right with the one that's you know how big America is. Yeah, that's America is, is a great city. Yeah, but how about Shmuel Shai is going to pour out his, uh, his uh, indignation upon this uh, sinful kingdom yeah. and the neighboring cities, just like Sodom and Gomorrah. Yep. Right, it wasn't mm -hmm. just those two; it was five, five cities. Mm -hmm. Yep. So right. You got that nuclear outbreak. Might hit a little bit of Mexico, a yeah. little bit of Canada. Yep. You know, Alaska. The, yep. the, hey, the snow gonna melt in Alaska. Hawaii, all that. Yep. Yeah. 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 Well, the islands are gonna shake. And, and guess what? Through the nuclear missiles, it's going to bring up more land. Yeah. So the land's going to get bigger because the earth used to be a Pangea. Yeah. I mean, it was all one, but then when the flood came, it broke it up. So when the nukes come, some islands might go down and bigger lands might come up. Tectonic plates are going to shift. Yep. It's going to revitalize the earth. Like when somebody's dead, they do the thing. What's the thing? Defibrillator. Yeah. Defibrillator? Yeah. You're clear? That's what the nukes are going to do. And it's going to clear the place of wickedness and the wicked adventures by the wicked elites. Right, man. You know? And the first slaves, captives of servants in our kingdom, is going to be the elites. It's going to be the Illuminati. Because they're the ones that got a money to hide in bunkers, deep underground uh, uh, bases or going into space. So they're going to hide from the nukes too. Yeah. But that's only going to preserve them for the first crops of slavery. That's right. And it says, and, that, and, that's, and that's in the uh, scriptures too. Yep. And it says, uh, hide thyself as it were for a little moment until the indignation. Indignation, and the word indignation is what? Righteous anger. All right. Until the indignation be overpassed. And the destruction be overpassed. You know? And then that's why it says, uh, mingle with glass. Right, yeah. And was it Rev 15? Yeah. Uh, right here. May I? Yeah. This is Rev Revelations 15. And, um, uh, I'll just start at one. It says, And I saw another sign in heaven, 
great and marvelous, seven angels having the seven last plagues, for in them is filled up the wrath of the Most High. And I saw, as it were, a sea of glass mingled with fire, which is what? We're going to be so high up, we're going to be past the firmament, yep, yep. or what they call the Van Halen belt. Yep. So we're going to see the firmament the, you know, that, uh, that surrounds the earth and the fire below it. Yep. Right. Bird's eye view. Bird's eye view. Right. That's what John had a vision. Yep. yep. And it says, and, uh, it says, uh, and them that had gotten the victory over the beast and the uh, the beast, oh, well, the beast ultimately being uh, Esau's regime, mm -hmm. which you know is the NATO EU, because America could still be destroyed, but you still got the neighboring countries, NATO EU. Mm -hmm. They still got the monetary system through the Brits. So the false prophet Vatican. So a lot's got to be destroyed. Yep. Ultimately, not just America, because that's what the hammer to earth being broken will be America. But he's got other things going on. So the you know the UNs. Yep. It says, over the beast and over his image uh, and over his mark, the mark of the beast, you see, meaning they refused it, yep. they, they were faithful unto death. Mm -hmm. And it says, and over the number of his name, stand on the sea of glass, having harps of the most high. See, right. so they're gonna be, uh, uh, they're gonna be standing. I uh, uh, feel like I'm on top of the world. Right, that, that's where that comes from. That's, you know, I feel yeah. like I'm on top of the world, man. That's that victory, man. Yep, and that's how we gonna feel. That day we gonna feel like winners. All right, you know. But I gotta, gotta finish this, and then so after all that, <laughs> after all that, then this, Revelations 21 and 2, and I, John, saw the holy city. New Jerusalem coming down. Yep. See, yeah. now it makes yeah. sense. Yeah. Yeah. This is First Thessalonians four and thirteen. But I would not have you to be ignorant, brethren, concerning them which are asleep, which ye, that ye sorrow not, even as others which have no hope, because there's going to be martyrs. There's going to be some of us that have to that have to die. But even if you die, you still gonna get demons. Right. Because why? Because it's that Psalms 116 it says it says precious. It says precious in the sight of the Lord. It, uh, the death of the right, saints. The, the, the death of the saints. Precious. You know, being a martyr. Which yeah. means what the Lord respects them. Yeah. Yeah. Like the like, how should I say? It proves them to uh, to please them. To them. Yeah, yeah. No uh, greater yes. love. When a man laying down his life for his friends. That's the house I did for the elect. So technically, you know, if we're, if, if, if uh, the Most High looks at us as a friend, because of the wisdom, the you know, the relationship, then we look look at the Most High as a friend as well. You know, because we're dying for Yahweh Bashem right. Shai. You know, not for our own will. Right. You know, some men will jump in front of a bullet for their president, you know, or their children or wife, because they love them. Yeah. So, but us, we're here to die for the Lord, because right. we love them. You know, for if we believe that Yahweh died and rose again, you believe you believe he died and rose again, brother? Yes, that's right. right. That's right, brother. And he coming back. That's right. Right. You got, you got to believe it. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Back. Even so, them yes. also which are asleep in Yahweh Shai, will Yahweh bring with him? Mm. For this we say unto you by the word of the Lord, that we which are alive and remain yep. unto the coming of the Lord. Oh, real quick. It said, we which are alive and remain, when you go into that word remain, it goes into the word survive. Yeah. The word survive means to live after one's death. Yeah. So those that are alive and survive mass death, uh, a thousand on one side, not, Psalms 91. Yeah. Oh, so that's the spirit. So us that survive the mass death that will be going on before the nukes, right. keep going. Got a quick precept, Dr. Shaw. Sure. This is the book of Saint, uh, Saint Mark 9 and verse 1. And he said to them, Very I say unto you, that there be some of them that stand here which shall not taste of death till they have seen the kingdom of the most high come with power. So right, so there's gonna be some brothers you know that you know, uh, that, uh, that's gonna survive everything. Everything. And then at the end, they, that's why it says he that endure until the end and shall be saved. Yeah. I ain't gonna be saved, delivered through those chariots. Yeah, man, that's very comforting. So that's you right. might not even die. You, you might not might right. do everything. All right. Yep. You might be sitting here meditating, I'm gonna be in the FEMA. Oh, they're gonna lock me down, but f that. Right. And the whole time, like, nah, that's not for you, because mm -hmm. we we might have already died. Uh, in the people first. Yeah, yeah. Are here. Back in Thessalonians chapter four, verse fifteen, 
For this we say unto you by the word of the Lord, that we which are alive and remain unto the coming of the Lord shall not prevent them which are asleep. Yep, and, and, and uh, the ones that are asleep are the martyrs, you know, or the men that uh, uh, that passed on, you know, at uh, uh, no, the beginning, you know, and then doing the work, right, doing doing the work. work. and then you could get delivered up, and they'll be right there on the ship. Yep. Oh, right. you know, <laughs> you go, oh, it's Elijah right here. Right. You know. Yep. For the Lord himself, Yahweh Shai himself, shall descend from heaven with a shout, with the voice of the archangel, and with the trump of Yahweh, and the dead and Yahweh Shai shall rise first. That's it right there, the dead, and, uh, the dead and Yahweh Shai shall rise first. You know, you got uh, Abba Bibbins, you got uh, King Masha, a lot of brothers. Yeah, a lot of brothers, man. That you know? pass doing this. Oh, uh, what, uh, what's the uh, brother, the Benjamite, the powerful speaker? Oh, uh, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Come on, man, yeah. man, it was the elect, bro. Yeah. It was the elect. You've had men doing what we're doing now in the spirit hard since, mm -hmm. you know, 90s. But before that, but real heavy, you've seen them on in New York in the 90s. Teaching, teaching, teaching. Mm -hmm. Some of them have passed. Some of them fell away and don't do it no more. You know what I mean? But Because ultimately, the Lord's got to be with you for you to be doing this. Yeah. You know, that. You know he has to be. Yeah. So you had men that literally did this until they passed on yeah. but it's saying that even though they passed on they're coming back that's right they're coming back because you got to think back in the 90s we didn't have the full understanding now so like uh bon Loya, he was doing that to to their understanding then yeah. their measure that's then measure. yeah yeah you know but guess what he was still preaching he was, that word he was still yeah, yeah. So that's why he's going to be the, you know, yeah. delivered because he uh, pro a prophesizing part that's right you know part. and the dead and yahweh shy shall rise first just like when he passed Remember, we read it in Matthew 26 or 27. Yep. They came, they rose first out the graves. Full circle. That's right. See? Then we which are alive and remain shall be brought up together with them in the clouds. In the cloud and chariot. All right. To meet, to meet the Lord in the air. Yep. So shall we ever be with the Lord. Wherefore, comfort one another with these words. Woo! And that's very comforting to know that we have a Savior coming to, to uh, deliver us. What's that song? Sweet, low, swing, swing chariot. chariot. Yeah. You know, yeah. Coming to take me home. That, that that like that's scripture, yeah. you know, and, and that's what we sung during chattel slavery, man. Yeah. And that's gonna happen in these last days. Yeah, so it don't matter now if we dead or we endure to the end. Either mm -hmm. way, we gonna be right, yeah. you know. But uh, a living dog's better than a dead, dead lion. lion. Yeah. So it says, your, uh, it says your works do follow. That's right, yeah. right. Yep. But like uh, Paul said, uh, for it's necessary that I I'm remain here. So we are, we're not in a like. If I get, it's, you know, excuse my language, if I die today. No, nah, we understand we we got the most high is a God of the living. So we got to we got to want to be alive to do this. You know, but if some brothers happen to die while doing it, that's not going to change their position. Right. Going back because their works follow them, you know, but back to Rev. Yeah, yeah. Revelations 21. And I'll just read two again. And it says, uh, and I, John, saw the holy city, New Jerusalem, and might I add, which we didn't go into, when you're getting beamed up, you're gonna be changed in a twinkling of an eye. So you're not even gonna look like you. We get beamed up, I'm not gonna need glasses, you're not gonna need an asthma puffer, you ain't gonna need aspirin, back brace, knee brace, full beard. you ain't gonna need no icy hot, you know? No contacts, nothing. You ain't, you ain't gonna need that. <laughs> yeah, everything straight, beard, good. You're gonna, you're gonna be everything. You're gonna be complete, perfect, you know, and it's gonna, like that yeah. it's gonna be just like that yeah. and it says um revelation 21 and 2 and i john saw the holy city new jerusalem coming down from the most high out of heaven prepared as a bride adorned for her husband. right right yeah. and, and just like the uh like a uh, like a wedding today yeah. you know the you, you, uh, the bride is waiting for the, right. it's like the, the groom is waiting for the bride right you know when that word adorned it means prepared Right. You know, so the groom was waiting, you know, uh, you know, uh, uh, for that bride, you know, right. deliverance. You know? Right. So if you will, even though there's predestination under grace, we're still trying to get right yeah. to be ex an acceptable bride yeah. to the Lord. Yeah. You see, so that's why we don't commit, uh, you know, uh, spiritual adultery right, right. or we're a little bit of the Islam. Right. Hey, right. That's like having another man, uh, your woman. You're her man, but she got another man in her phone yeah, that she yeah. talks to sometimes. Yeah. He's just a friend. Yeah, nah, that's not you, uh, what he, my man, he just died. You yeah, said he's just a friend. Right. Oh, baby, you. She, she did it wrong. But you know, a 
lot of these celebrities, what y'all don't know is I listen to, they call it the Savage Robot. I don't mean to interrupt y'all. But if you listen to the Savage Robot, they tell you what they do. Mm. They they are sacrifices. Yep. They, a lot of them already made their blood sacrifice. Mm. They already, you know, accepted yep. their, so that's why you count. see a lot of them dying. Yep. And um, not just them, but, you know, you got a lot of pastors, you got yep. a lot of the ones, TV gospel yep. singers, as well. Yep. Not all of them. I, I can't say all of them. But, but we, know. those that are but up there, the ones I see, there's a certain door right, that right. you walk so through. I see them talking about so, oh, yeah, brother. They, it's real. Yeah, yeah, man. It's real. Yep. And guess what? They taking them out. They taking their family members out and stuff yeah. like that, man. I, I be like, you know, and that's ultimately, not a surprise to me, but right. that's what, just what's going on. Ultimately, that's the Lord judging them because they're not supposed to have another God over them. Right. Exactly. They said, fear no other God, serve right. no other God, bow to him, don't sacrifice. Right. That's and that's right. what Israel's always known for. Right. So it makes sense that these so-called black uh, entertainers, Latino, you know, even you have Native American entertainers that look black, yep. that aren't, but just saying right. it, they've done very shameful things, yeah. as the Bible says. Right. It says uh, it is a shame for us to speak right. Right. what they actually do, but it does get leaked. Yeah. So we are aware there's a lot of satanic rituals yes. that they're bound to. Yeah. That's why they can't just come out of that. They can't. Because Satan's on them. Yeah. Demons are, you can't, and they don't got the Lord to rebuke it. They, they can't. So they, even if they want to, they couldn't. They can't. You know? Yeah. That's why Dwayne Wade is the way he is. Oh, yeah. He's bound to that. He can't get out of that. Yep. He's a prisoner of uh, uh, death. Yeah. Like we're a prisoner of hope. Yeah. But he's a prisoner bound to Esau. Yeah. He made a covenant with death. Made, which yeah. it will be disannulled, yeah. but during destruction. That's why it says it's, uh, it's, uh, uh, it's uh, hard for a rich man to, to get into the kingdom of heaven. Yep. Like, like, do you think LeBron can just say, I'm done playing basketball, come to the truth? Nah, they, they, they'll they off his ass. He's got a deity yeah. tattooed yeah. on his chest. He made a covenant. Yeah. He's done. He's, He's got to live by the spirit. Anyway. Yeah, exactly. Well, he just got out of it. Did y'all brother see uh, this morning a WNBA player? She, I guess she said she was missing for two years. And she said that, uh, thank you. Thank you, brother. She uh, said she was missing for two years, and she said that LeBron James is linked in a sex trafficking. Woo! So you don't know what they're doing, man. Right. You don't know what they're doing. Right. You know? Also, that guy, Phil. Dr. Phil, Phil talking about? Phil yeah, yeah. Well. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. A lot of them, so, he's a witch. That, yeah. he, he's a witch. Yeah. He's a witch. Yeah. Uh, first 50, 50. Oh, it's first? Like, it's like, I'm sorry, but you might have a precept. Okay. First Corinthians 15 and verse 44, it is sown a natural body, it is raised up a spiritual body. There is a natural body and there is a spiritual body. Yep. And so it is written, the first Adam was made a living soul, the last Adam was made a quickening spirit. And that's who you have a shot. Yep. Did you know that? Who you know as Jesus was Adam? When you read in Genesis, he was that Adam. Right. Because there's reincarnation. So he came right. back as Adam. Right. That's why he also, too, uh, when uh, he had to pay for his sins. Remember, it says he had to pay. What sins, though? If he was a lamb without blemish, the sins of his past life. Because going back to the priesthood, the priests, before they could sacrifice for us, they would have to give a sacrifice for them right. so that their sacrifice for us would be acceptable. Exactly. See, so that's why he was the first Adam, but now the last right. Adam. Because right. through the first Adam, we got cursed. Yeah. Cursed is the ground. Yep. You know, you didn't need to plant seed or agriculture. So the, that got the curse, the sweat of thy brow, I'm sweating out. Yeah. You know, so we go through these fleshly things now. But when we get in the kingdom, hey, we'll have servants trimming and doing this, but life is going to grow. Yeah, right. Things are going to, you know, flourish. You know, because yeah. they put seeds in the earth right. and then they grew, right. you know. Verse uh, 45. And so it is written. The first man, Adam, was made a living soul. The last Adam was made a quickening spirit. Howbeit, that was not that was not first which is spiritual, but that which is natural, and afterward that which is spiritual. The first man is of the earth, earthy. The second man is of the Lord from heaven. As is the earthy, such are they also that are earthy. And as is the heavenly, such are they also that are heavenly. And as we have borne the image of the earthy, 
we shall also bear the image of the heavenly. Right. You, know, what, you, know, you got it. You know, you got our new bodies. Yep. You know, that, uh, that soon we're going to receive. Yep. You know? yep. 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 Now this I say, brethren, that <clears throat> flesh and blood cannot inherit. Right. This flesh right here we got, it, it, it's sinful, it's wretched. We cannot inherit the kingdom of Yahweh Hashem Shai in this weak ass flesh. Right. No. Yeah, it's like you got dinner, you got invited to a wedding, the wedding. Yep. But then you come in with prison clothes on. Like, right. You, you, yeah, can't, you can't. You can't even come in here with that. You get the memo. Yeah. Right. You can't come in here with that. See. Now I, this I say, brother, that flesh and blood cannot inherit the kingdom of Yahweh Hashem Shai. Neither does corruption. Inherit in corruption. Yep. Behold, I show you a mystery. We shall not all sleep, yep. but we shall all be changed. And that's literal. We shall all be changed. You know, like, like for example, like a super saiyan. The person is saying, he changed to a super saiyan. You know, he got a new body, he got a better aura, he's stronger, faster, quicker. You know, he uh, makes the uh, he's more pure. You know, and with our new bodies, and that's how it's going to be. No, it's gonna be like it's gonna be like us in our first estate. You know, our, our primary bodies. You no, know? that's why first you had to change what your mind and your spirit. Right. And then your body's gonna get changed. Exactly. See, because that being born again. Right. See, so what, what has been changed are our mind and spirit. Right. And then come the growth of the body per right. se. Right. Because the Most High is not about carnality first. Right. Says work the fathers of spirit, so we gotta worship them in spirit. But then there'll be there'll be a blessing after when we get the kingdom of heaven. Ain't that ain't this what it's for? Right. Getting to heaven? Yeah. But what we didn't know is heaven's gonna be on earth. Right. You see? Because right. there's uh three heavens. Yeah. And we're gonna we, we you know we got we got next. Right. So come. We shall not all sleep, but we shall all be changed right. in Change. a moment. Right, change in a moment. What's that called? Metamorphosis. Uh, we're gonna be gonna actually transform and evolve right right evolve in the twinkling of an eye in the twinkling of an eye fashion fast 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 snap right yeah. you know fast oh at a beck yep at that's a beck fast. instantly that's fast, that's fast. That's and you know what the world is going to actually think that we're aliens it's an alien invasion right they're going to go they're going to really you know like and then that. we're going to have to really break it in like right. god this is we, this is the bible yeah see when it when the thing when the time comes the superheroes are going to be walking the earth, if you will. Right. X-Men. <laughs> in a moment, in the twinkling of an eye, at the last trump, for the trumpet shall sound, and the dead shall be raised incorruptible. Yep, and, and, and that last trump was what? The nuclear missiles. Yeah, not Donald Trump. <laughs> right, the nuclear missiles. And that's that last trump. That's that last oak. You know, the elect seal, boom. Go ahead, you know. And we shall be changed. We shall be changed, yep. For this corruptible must put on incorruption. Yeah, this, this, this flesh, you know, it got to put on basically immortality, you know. And this mortal must put on immortality. Immortality. That's this flesh, you know, uh, becoming in, in, like a new terrestrial body, a, a, a new God-given uh, body. Celestial uh, and terrestrial. Right, celestial and terrestrial. Yeah. You no. Know? Spirit and uh, flesh. Like for example, just like uh, uh, what's his name, Superman, for example. He was a so-called alien, but he was in the flesh. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Because his name uh, was the Cal Ka L. Cal L. Yeah. You know, which means all power. Yep. Yeah. Call yeah. meaning all L power. Yep. So he had a Hebrew name. Yeah, that's great. You, you, you need some spray? You need some spray from your throat? Some water? Give him the other uh, spray. You, you only need one you only need one drop. Hey, and this why we need new bodies. Like for us taking the what like brothers got a parched. Miles and shit, man. You yeah, know? just the back, like Banaka. <laughs> <laughs> First throw since drive. Oh, you missed it. You, know? you missed it, brother. He did like uh, Jim Carrey. Yeah, man. <laughs> That's good stuff. But let me read this. This is uh, Philippians 3 and 20. Um, and it reads, for our conversation is in heaven. Yep. From whence also we look for the Savior, the Lord Yahweh Shai Hamashiach. Right, who is that the late? Because uh, uh, we hope for Yahweh Shai's return. Who shall change our vile bodies? Who shall change our vile bodies? Like this, this body is disgusting. Yeah. Like we have parasites in us. We get yeah. pimples and zits. We have blackheads. You know, we, uh, we stink. You don't shower for a couple of days. Stink breath. Everything. People stink even after they shower. Yeah. You know. And um, we get pimples because that's toxins leaving yep. our body. Yeah. So we got toxins, man. Mm -hmm. You know. And then within that, like like we uh, 
we try to get good to like uh, 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 like uh, you know uh, as much as we can. But within that, the things he still defiled. You know, they got they got chips that say uh, G- non-GMO, but then when you flip the ingredients, the, some of the ingredients is GMO. Oh man, <laughs> like or you just can't pronounce. You know, yeah. so they do they do health as a as a uh, fashion statement. Like, mm-hmm. Yeah, it's, it's a money scheme. We're actually trying to be healthy. Right. But what we know, what we know though, is the ultimate health and wealth is through the spirit. That's right. So we just we endure what we got to endure. We right. do the best of our ability. Right. But the main focus is, you know, mind, soul, you know, spirit, then right. body per se. Right. Like they say, mind, body, soul. Yep. But uh, Philippians three and twenty one, who shall change our vile body, our flesh, that it may be fashioned. Like unto his glorious body. Like, because you gotta think about it. What do, what do it say? The master, the, 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 uh, that the servant is not greater than the master. Yeah. And, and, right. and, and, yeah. and Shai came to sinful flesh, but guess what? He got beamed up and he got a, a, a new body. Well, so how, how much more did he Right, left, right. You know? It actually said it behooved him to come as uh, his kinfolk of Abraham, mm-hmm. you know, Isaac, Jacob. It behooved him. You see, that there's a reason why who they know as Jesus is a Hebrew Israelite. He could have been any nation, right. but he, why was he? Because he came for his people. Right. His name means he's, he saves. Right. He's got, and save who? His people that were given this law yeah. and being judged by, yeah. and killed by, taken over by. We have guidelines that we were only set up to live by. Yeah. And, and we even had our wicked people oppressing us with the law. Yeah. You know, so he saved us not only from the law, but from wicked people yeah. it, right. using the law against us. Cause we still we don't make void the law, right. but we can't live it up to the best of our right. ability. Right. That's why the new covenant is gonna be put in you. Right. Yeah. You know, it makes so much sense. Yeah. You know, cause even going back to Adam, they lived by laws. Cause remember Cain and Abel sacrifice. Yeah. But did, did, was it written down? It was oral. Right. Right. That's why it says the breath of life was breathed in the man. Right. What was breathed in was the wisdom, the knowledge, the laws, right. understanding. Right. You know, the way of life right. that we have now written down. And it says, Philippians 3 and 21, who shall change our vile bodies, body, that it may be fashioned like unto his glorious like body. His glorious body, you know? Yep. Uh, uh, because it says what? It says, uh, Isaiah 47, I shall not meet you as a man. Yep. And how shall I come back in his glorious apparel, glorious body? Yep. You know? Yep. And it says, uh, according to the working whereby he is able even to subdue all things unto himself. Mm-hmm. That was a First Corinthians 15 and 54. So when this corruptible <clears throat> shall have put on incorruption and this mortal shall have put on immortality, then shall be brought to pass the saying that is written, death is swallowed up in victory. Death is swallowed up in victory. Right. Yep. Well, wait. Well, why is, why, why is death swallowed in victory? Because death comes by what? Sin. Sin. And sin is transgression of the law. You see? So that's why death will be swallowed up. Oh, death, where is thou sting? Yep. Right? You're going, hey, you might be there, and they're going to open fire, and, you know, you you think you, and you're like, oh, where, where the sting of death? Right. The Lord ain't, you don't got it, the sting of death no more. You see? Deliverance is here now. Right. You know? Oh, grave, where is thou victory? Yep. Mm. The sting of death is sin, and the strength of sin it's the law. See, see. Yep. That, right. The, the, uh, the strength of sin is the law. You know, because the, like the law, like like we can't keep it perfect. Right. You know, like and that's why we need to have a shy. You know, for, uh, for, for grace and mercy. That's why, like that's why we uh, we uh, we uh, repent those names. Yeah. How about Shmuel Shai forgive us? You know. And that's why Paul was pushing that so hard mm-hmm. because you had Israelites that all they knew was you know Old Testament per se, the laws of Moses, some of the prophets, but they didn't fully understand them. So that's why Paul came in the Holy Spirit, constantly pushing. Right. But that's why he said in Romans 3, we don't make void the law. Right. Right. Just know you don't got to sacrifice no more. He had to tell the Ephesians, damn, who's already bewitched you? Yeah. Are you sacrificing right. again? Right. You don't need to. Right. He already did it for you. Right. Right. That's why you got to tell Jake more than like multiple times. Like, hey, bro, you know, do this, don't do that. Yeah. You know? But thanks be to Yahweh. Which given us the victory right, through body, our Lord. Right, yeah. Why do you have a up, Which given us the victory through our Lord, Yahweh Shah Hamasiyat. Therefore, my beloved brethren, be steadfast, mm-hmm. unmovable, yep. always abounding in the work of the Lord, for as much as he as ye know. 
that your labor is not in vain in the Lord. Right, right now our labor, you know, our faith, you know, that we do, you know, uh, throughout works is not in vain. Because right now people, you know, they may have like a 401k plan. They right. may have like like a certain goals and short term and, and mid term and you know, long term goals. But guess what? That's all vanity. Yeah. You know, King Simon say, say, he said, uh, he said, uh, he said uh, all everything, is right, all is vanity. Everything done under the sun is vanity. Yeah. All the works that I do with my hands is vain. But these works we do right now, we're doing the will of Yahweh Shai. Not vain because they're gonna follow us. You know. But it's a spell because what Esau has done, Esau, the so-called white man, woman, the ruler of this world right now. What he has done and as he's bewitched our people to give their life over to vain vanity to feel prosperous right you know uh, uh th there's there's so many things yeah. you know it really honestly football nfl yeah nb that's vain yeah that's vain because now look at now look what they're forcing on you yeah. you lived your whole life yeah. day in day out blood sweat tears sore bones concussions right to take that little pig skin right. run up and down the field for the white man and now for his ass to say, bend over and get this shot. Right, right, right. right you know, right. it's all vanity. Yeah, right. But he's he's promoted it like, damn, I need, I need that trophy. I need yep. that ring. Right. You know, I need that medal. That Grammy. Right. You know, you got him right now in Tokyo. Uh, uh, Kevin uh, Durantula mm -hmm. and uh, old girl Simone Ballone, yeah. whatever her, they're out there flipping and flopping for Esau just to get a, a, a fucking a gold a nickel plated right. idol. Right. It's an idol. Yeah. Just like the Emmys, it's an idol. Yeah, oh, are, I've yeah. done it, you know? Right. You know? I, I like to thank myself. Yep, yeah. yep. Right. I'll be like, yep. 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 See? <laughs> yeah, bro. But that's Esau that's done that. Yeah. Making you uh, train all summer to swallow 100 hot dogs in a half an hour right. to go to a contest. That's vain. Mm -hmm. You can work in a job for 20 plus years and Esau bring a new guy in and then he lays your ass off. Then you then you wake up and pay your more money. Yeah, then you wake up and the schedule that you had full, it's empty now. Yeah. Yeah. Right. Yeah. 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 You be like, what the hell? What happened? You see? It's vain. You you've given your life to vanity. None of these people, they can't deliver us, save us. You got men giving their lives to women. Yeah. And then she might watch the right music video. Now she wants to be a man. So this, you're giving your life to nothing, you know? And that's what this world promotes to our people. They give them false sense of hope and reality with a vain success story. Yep. You know? Chasing the dream. Yep. Matthew 6, verse 19. Lay not up for yourself treasures upon earth. Upon earth, right. where moth and rust doth corrupt. Right, right. Like you got every people out here. Like, like they, uh, they, they love cars. You know what I mean? Like, ain't nothing wrong having a hobby, but like, damn, don't like don't be consumed in it. Like people, like they, like they have the mind set on indulging in Babylon, the uh, the next big thing. Female, you know, you no know, money. You know. Well, when LeBron James was at playing a game, he came home to nigger on his yep. game. Wow. And yeah. you know what his big ass said? I'll, I'll just buy more paint. Yep. So is that stopping the problem? I just stay the paint. Right, well, he's throwing up, but he's throwing up all that shit for Satan. Yep. Yeah. That Esau 